Monday morning to you. If you're just now waking up or maybe you're getting ready to head out of the door there, the time right now, 521. And if you like those cooler temperatures, yes. which Frankie loves, you're going to be happy this week. Right. Actually, six out of the seven days. Lisa will be happy on Wednesday afternoon. Okay, good. <laughs> It's going to be 105. No, no I'm just it's kidding. not. Not it's here. Be, it'll be 80. That's not bad. That's awesome. It should I like that. It'll be a that. beautiful day on Wednesday. Let's first talk about this morning. I'm starting you off with a psychedelic satellite picture because it kind of looks that way. See these yellow streaks? That's some new lake effect clouds just beginning to form. Now, the purple is still clearer skies. The reason why I'm making a big deal about this is the look at the future cache kind of expanding this cloud cover. It might not get this thick, but it does tell you between now and mid morning, we will probably turn at least mostly cloudy with an opportunity at a brief shower or sprinkle. Then that moves away and we go back to first intervals of sun and then a wealth of sunshine this afternoon. The thing is, much like Friday afternoon, late afternoon when it got sunny, we have a brisk northwest wind, so the temperature isn't moving very much. Numbers this afternoon only 60 to 65 and get set for the coldest night and coldest early morning of the season close to what we had Saturday morning. I actually think we'll go lower with widespread upper 30s to lower 40s almost everywhere except the shoreline of Lake Ontario. It would not surprise me Now we only have frost advisories and freeze warnings for Jefferson Lewis, Herkimer and Northern Oneida counties. I really do think some of the coldest countryside of Madison maybe even Southern Onondaga and especially Cortland and Shenango counties could also see some frost. So heads up farmers and gardeners. Otherwise tomorrow, sunny, cold start. Decent afternoon though, upper 60s is nice. A little warmer than this afternoon. And then remember Wednesday, we talked about it being warmest. We'll start in the 50s, but here you go, watch this. Sunshine, upper 70s to lower 80s. A little bit cooler from Hamilton to Cooperstown to Binghamton and the far north country, but easily the warmest and the prettiest day is Wednesday. So enjoy that because after that, we do have another system. Over my shoulder, there's a line of showers. This will likely come through on Thursday. Depending on when it comes through, if that front comes through faster, which I think happens, we're not going to get much higher than the upper 60s to near 70. If it gets delayed, maybe we're a little warmer. Right now, I think we're probably around 69 with some leftover rain and cloud cover. Not a ton of rain, just some light rain. Friday, chilly, sort of like today. Mixed sun and clouds, a brief shower. Speaking of which, this weekend will be sunny at this point, and it will be even cooler. Frost, again possible, both mornings this weekend, especially over the colder countryside. Now to sports.